Welcome back to 60 Second Series and today I'm talking about the evidence around sex offending and child sexual exploitation. So I'm going to put 60 seconds on the clock and it's on. Okay, so one of the issues that we are facing in child sexual exploitation is this strange sort of reinvention of the wheel. That actually we have experts in criminology, psychology, sociology that have been looking at sex offending for at least sort of, I would say empirically and really in quite a lot of theoretical detail, at least 50 years. But if you started, if you started going back, you're looking at at least a hundred odd years. And the field of child sexual exploitation seems to have managed to completely circumvent all of that evidence, which leads to people saying things in the media like, we need more understanding and evidence about the boyfriend model. It's really important that people start looking at existing literature. If you're going to write something, if you're going to talk about sex offending and child sexual exploitation, I implore you to conduct a literature search before you start talking because it's already there and you can learn so much.